Hi guys, Flisk here. Welcome to another Fallout 3 Let's Play. Well, I just moved the camera on my monitor. So, welcome back to the Pit DLC. And if you remember, we got all the 100 stealing gods and are currently equipped with the Mauler. Which is just amazing. Fantastic damage capability of the Mauler. What other weapons have we got? I believe this is a automatic rifle. I've also got an assault rifle there. Got a dull sidearm. Got a metal blaster of some description. This is just a powerful laser rifle. Got a ten a normal 10mm pistol. And got some frag grenades there. It's got a flamethrower, which is nice. The quests we've got in here then. So return to Medea. Let's return to Medea. So as you can tell, like uh, this mill is really, really loud. I just realised how loud the mill is. Um, Stimpak's taken three six one. There's quite a lot. Only three bobbleheads found though. So I need to go and try and find the rest of them. I've decided as well, I'm getting my new computer relatively soon. Um, I was going to do such a large Fallout 3 playthrough, um, covering like every single nook and cranny and getting every single thing and doing every single side quest. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... My three objectives, I do all the DLC, and this one is the last DLC that doesn't tie in with the main story, like the... The other DLC, that um, which is Broken Steel, I think, that kind of continues, as you know, the main story of Fallout 3. Um, and that is, like, you know, it stops you, like, you know, from having to die at the end. And you continue the game and you've got more areas to explore and you've got to deal with the Enclave and all that stuff. So I'm going to complete the main story quest objectives, a few side ones that I find interesting and or fun on the way, uh, all the DLCs and then uncover every location, like find every location um, and like explore every location that I find on the map. Other than that, that's it. Like that's probably where I'll end it. Um, basically, not only am I ordering my new PC soon, but I haven't got a lot of time with a lot of raiding on Warcraft, playing with other games and also uh, working a lot. I'm working 66 hours this week, for example, so it's a lot of work and it does mean that I uh, very much need to Let's see he kicks that barrel up. Oh he's gotta leave them to it. Can't really do anything about that, it's gotta leave them to it really when they do that. Um, so yeah, um, haven't really got them the larger it's the amount of time in the world. Finding Wild Bill? Wild Bill, oh yeah, yeah, I found him in the still yard. Oh that's wonderful. Where is he now? Did he come back with you? Speech and said, Bill likes to hear he's okay, but he can't back. He said, I had Bill's blood curling spoons and I knew I was too late. Lie. Uh, I'm going to do that one. Because it's not a full on lie. He knew I was, I knew I was too late. He's dead, so. Oh no! Five experience, that sucks. That's all. Bill. Well, he was calling for you. I had to put him out of his misery. Please, please stop. I, I can't hear any more of it. I, I don't feel so well. He wants. He's one tough bastard. Took every shot of my pistol. No, I'm just kidding. I found Bill didn't. He's dead. But he promised us he would come back. I, I, I... here. Take. What? No. Just get back to work. Poor Millie. Never mind. So, onwards. See, I haven't got as much time as I thought I would, and I want to get this out of the way as soon as possible. It shouldn't take too long. I mean, this DLC is not Good. far off done. Just in time. Asher has ordered everyone into the square. Rumor has it that he's going to open up the arena. That's perfect for us. Anyway, before I go anywhere, you have to explain this plan to me. It's simple, really. From time to time, Asher opens up the arena. Any slave who wants to can fight against the gladiators. If you win, you get your freedom. 
More importantly, you get an audience with Asher. It's the only way a slave will ever get to talk to him directly. You fight, you win, and when you talk to Asher, you take the cure. Nice. Do I have to kill him to get it? I wouldn't shed a tear, but no. Warner has a distraction planned. We haven't been making these weapons for nothing, you know. But when you're meeting with Asher, you'll be close enough to grab the cure. Get it and bring it to me. Now let's get out there and listen to Asher's speech. There'll be hell to pay if the guards catch us in here. Yes, they will. Let's go. I bring you good news! We stand at the dawn of a new golden age, where others merely survive. We thrive! And while I have led your efforts, it has been by your own strength that you have earned all the envy of the world. And most of all, they envy our victories in the struggle for freedom. Because yes, freedom is what we all and work so, towards. To celebrate this struggle, I ask my loyal workers, who among you is prepared to fight for your freedom? Right here! We have one! This woman here will fight in the hole! Yes, Come on, Asher. yes I will. Will you send someone to the hole who actually stands a chance? Also, this armor looks badass, I have to say. Madam, you carry not only the dream that workers can become free, but that we may all someday become truly free from the threats of our world! And there's two of them talking at the same time. You one head down to the hole. Talk to win. Phaedra. She sets up the fights. So I've got to go. Find it for the arena. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, gotta go to the bin to the mill. Wait. At least they cure your radiation when you come out of the hole. Nothing I love more than watching your grinders die and come out of the hole. What's really cool is that obviously because we did a hundred steel ingots, we've got all of this equipment and weapons and stuff. The person I am fighting against will die so horribly. They will get utterly destroyed. Like whoever it is I'm fighting against will get utterly wrecked. Um, plus, not only that, but we are a very high level and you can go to the pit while it is a bit of a walk, you can go to the pit quite early. So, um, you can be a relatively low level, low level and have low, relatively few perks, etc. Um, so, yeah. That's the arena where you fight. And in there, it's obviously radiation sickness. Uh, there's radiation. I can't stand What a bitch. Anyway, let's move on. Gotta go to somewhere. Yeah. Arena's this way. Gone the wrong way? Who do I talk to? So here we've gotta go. I think yeah, in here. Don't be stalled though. Maybe in there. Some bottle caps, I'll take those. So you're the dumbass scab that signed up to fight in the hole, huh? Well, head on down. Phaedra's waiting for you. <laughs> Love the voice acting. So good. Bits of, well, stuff everywhere. And what are you doing down here, slave? Don't tell me your pale ass is gonna throw down. Where do I sign up? You don't sign up. You tell me that you want to fight, I set up a fight. You die, and I repeat it with the next jackass slave who comes in here. What a bitch. Sound good? You want in? Come on, death's gotta be better than your life, am I right? Uh, what are the arena rules? It's pretty simple. When the gates open, you fight. Last one standing wins. Of course, when the gates open, the barrels drop in. 
So just make sure you kill the other guy before you die of radiation poisoning. You don't want to spend too much time with whatever's in those barrels. Uh, do I got any weapons? You have what you take in with you. But if that's not enough, there are a couple of things in that locker over there. What's to tell? Most die. Now, one or two have made it out, but that's about it. Uh, right, I have to go now. All right. Right, locker. What's in here then? Thirty to cover. We'll take the ammo. Yeah, it's fuck all in here. So obviously, it's a good thing we've got to kill some stuff else then. Is that, is that Rad X? We'll take the Rad X. And we'll also. Yeah, it should be fine. Well, we'll quick save it anyway. Man, I can't believe Asher opened up the arena again. Unless you're looking to get killed. Find the arena. Oh, yeah. Yes, put me down for a fight. Well, alright. I've got one for you right away. Or you could. Then we're gonna be fighting. We're gonna throw you in there with a bunch of the other scabs who think they've got what it takes. You're all gonna fight it out, and the last one standing gets to move on. Probably won't be you, though. Have you seen what I'm wearing, woman? Have you seen my weapons? Fuck you. My weapon's better than your assault rifle. Let's do it. If you're ready. Alright, let's fuck them up. Rusty gate into the hole. They will fight! They will die! And all for you! All for your entertainment! There are like two people watching it there. Oh wow. Holy shit, is this like a scatter laser? No, it's like a scatter laser. That's disgusting. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, what I am gonna go is I am gonna go items, aid, and I'm gonna go right away. There we go. So I just want to grab whatever's on their bodies, you never know. Finger. Uh, combat shotgun might be useful, actually, that's a good point. What's he got? Shiny's assault rifle would be good. Yeah, of course, that's good. Let's fuck up out of here. Quick, 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 quick. Ow. One, fight! Wow. Impressive, slave. Those were some of the toughest scabs around here. You've got some fight in you, it seems. But I wouldn't get too excited. I'm sure Asher's got something special planned for your next fight. Here's something for the rads. Enjoy it while you can. Come back when you're ready for your next fight. You again? I wouldn't count on luck. Well, all right. Get in there or oh, die in here. I Either to, uh, way. Let's see what I was against. Oh well, it's let's fine. Let's find out if the newcomer can hold his own against. Is that a death core? No, he's got death core gauntlets though. Oh, I got tender ash. Death core gauntlet. That would be a nice weapon to have. Frag grenades. Gamma shield up. What is that? Should be able to make it to the door, and then I can. Don't have to worry about the rads, then, so I'll save my rad away. And then I can prepare, prepare what I can and see what I can. Not bad, with. Grinder, not bad. The Bear Brothers were some pretty mean sons of bitches. One more fight, and you're free. But I wouldn't plan on making it through the next one. Here's a shot for the rads. Come back when you're ready for your last fight. Nice, right, let's see what we've got then. Right, Gamma Shield, what am I wearing? Tribal Power Armor, I can't repair it with anything. Let's repair the Gamma Shield Armor with more Gamma Shield Armor. Leather Outfit, ah, oh, okay, that weighs too. Get rid of that, Leather Rebel. This is a cool value. Yeah, it's not really much. That weighs a lot, but it's worth a lot, but it weighs a lot. Might be worth keeping on just in case that. It's got more damage resistance than the Gamma. Hey, people's 15. Melee weapons plus 5, luck plus 1, strength plus 1, agility minus 1, trap power. Gamma shield armor, rads plus 15, agility minus 1. 
I like the tribal power armor, what, what it gives. Red iron cast armor. It's not really worth any much. Get rid of that. Get rid of the metal blast because it weighs a lot. Bombshell armor. Big guns plus 10, explosive plus 10. And it looks fucking amazing. If I just uh, show you what I mean. Oh, fucking. Look at those. Uh, but yeah, so we'll, uh, eh, it's not really worth much though. Control power armor, whatever. Weapons, let's see, Chinese assault rifle, repair. Rara assault rifle, because it'll do more damage. So, right, repair that combo, shock on that one. Repair the flamer. Perforator. Ah, okay, cool. Else there. Uh, steel knuckles that can be dropped. The mauler is pretty fucking awesome, so we'll keep it for now. Death core gold is pretty cool. Good knowing you scared. Uh, how do I get out of this area? <laughs> This is so good. Anyway. You again? This will. Who am I going to be fighting? You're going up against Gruber. He's one of the only slaves to win in the hole. There's only ever been, what, three? I guess he got a taste for blood. But unfortunately for you, he's got a pretty decent gun. So odds are this is. Alright, so we'll save it. Vats it up. Fuck it. Four, five shots in the head. This is. Oh, his head comes off. His head comes off. Made you stronger. You're now more resistant to radiation and damage. Nice. So finger infiltrator. Don't know the difference between the infiltrator and the perforator. And I might be able to repair my helmet with that, so I'll take that. Don't know the difference, I really don't. Also, he's sliding along the floor, which is a bit weird, but okay. Uh, let's go with... Right, first of all. Uh, can I repair my filtration helmet? No, I can't. Damage resistance 4. Damage resistance 3, so keep the filtration helmet for now. Plus rad resistance, which is nice as well. Let's have a look. Um, perforator. Damage 56. The infiltrator. Damage 51. So if I repair that. Oh, I can't repair. Oh, okay, they're different weapons. Weird. Get in there or die in here. Well, we now. Aren't you quite the scrapper? Congratulations. You've done well. Asher wishes to see you. The guards will be told to allow you to pass. Where can I find Asher? He watches over the city from Haven. His tower in Uptown. Take the northeast exit from here, and look for the tallest building in town. Oh, Asher also said that he has a few gifts for you. You'll find them in a container behind me. Enjoy! Let's have a look. Ah. Uh, is that my... That's, that's, that's my stuff. Which ones go away? Right, now I've got all my stuff back. Ah, winterized power up that go. That, ah, it all weighs a lot, doesn't it? So, fuck it, I've got, I've got 4,500 caps, I don't need a lot, so let's get rid of all 
of it. Holy shit, that was a lot. Right, what else there? Right, okay, so. Why am I weighing so much? Right, I only need one flamer really, so get rid of one of them. Don't need 44 frag mines, and I don't need 20 frag mines to get rid of those. That's a lot of weight gone. That is worth 250 for weighing two, which is really good value for money. So we'll keep it. Sniper rifle. Damage 47. Plasma rifle. Perforator. Compare one with one. Fucking hell, what else have we got? Microwave emitter. Minigun. Still got a lot of. Dirty water. Get rid of ten of those. Oh, I can get rid of the stuff that weighs one because I don't need them anymore. S S N E smart which there isn't. Get rid of the slop. Uh, get rid of three new colas. Get rid of the Milo cakes. Get rid of the whiskey. Oh shit! Cancel that. Shoot that stats. I've got forty to get rid of. Shit, that's a lot. Ah, uh, misc. Just got all the cleaner. They keep private Ryan then. Scrap metal. So f a lot of my weight is coming from the teddy bears and the scrap metal. Eh. Can't weapons I can realistically get rid of them? Ah, the man opener and the mauler. 48 for that much. The man opener is 41 for that for more. So the it, better, so get rid of the more the man opener. Uh, what else is there? Infiltrator. Right. That's a lot of stuff I've dropped. It's still heavy though. Uh, anything else I can do ahead? What's that? Infiltrator's 51. Perforator. We have traders in the one Uh, Perforator does 62 for that much. The other trail would be, it doesn't say. Uh, can I get rid of it? That's two combo shoppings. I want the other. Nine. Violence destabilizer is not full right. If I've got a gauntlet weighs 10, I don't really. If I've got the mauler, I'm not going to use the death core gauntlet to drop that. I don't really need money. Black water rifle. I can get rid of the temple pistol. It's a lot for weighing three though, I have to say. Wait. We can always come back down here later and pick some stuff up after we've given the teddies to that repeat request. Also, let's uh, heal myself up. Right, and let's quick save it there so we don't over there, so we don't have to do that again. Right, now that all that's done, we've done What's new? Have you heard anything? I may find a cure for the mutations of outside bit made help for the staves. I haven't heard anything. No, I haven't heard anything. Nothing. 
nothing interest of interest up there anyway, so that's it's going down. Up we go. Holy then now. Plot up the town. What else is there? What's up? So they give me like a basically a free ride, a free pass, which is great. Cool stuff. Ammo, nice. Remember, they can always these these things can always drop. You know, it's always capable of them dropping um, alien power cells, so it's always worth it. No need to kill the quantum. Says the woman patrolling a, a basically dead end corridor, but okay. Well, let's head to uptown then, I guess. And you know, I'm considering the damage, I'm considering that obviously this probably would have had a couple of new kits. I am extremely surprised that this mill is, you know, relatively. You know, I'm surprised. That, uh, re uh, surprised that it's relatively operational. You know, it's weird. Different pit, uh, pit boy designs, I think, on that uh, slide there, which is really cool. Never noticed that one before. Right, where are we? Okay, cool. Uptown, I think, now. Head up town, cool. Where else are we still let to discover? Remember, we've got the Explorer perk now. Haven's where we need to go. Uptown, which still we are. Downtown. Pit Bridge. Pit Train Yard. There's a bobby pin. I said it would be sad, but there is like a lot of bobby pins there. Whoosh. And in the apartments. Let's explore. Rad wrenches? Roaches, I can hear them. Uh, 
No new code. There's a ham radio. Let's see if we can find some. The fact that that's still flowing with water is a bit odd. For obvious reasons. Which are including, but not limited to, the fact that the water should have stopped flowing about 200 years ago. But okay. Oh shit, trucks. Well, I was expecting rad roaches, but I got trucks instead. The, oh god, that made me jump. I think, to be honest, that it's the um. There we go. I think, to be honest, it's the uh, limb damage that makes them all look fucking disgusting. Like the, the, the like the minute I the second I hit them, limbs are crippled. Like I think that might be one of the main things. Sexy sleepwear. Well, it looks like he was obviously trying to have sex with that uh, mannequin, or dressing it up. It's a bit freaky. Clear out this building and then I'll save it and... Uh... They're quite happy just to patrol. Right. Let's go. Ooh, nice. That worked. 50 experience. Barely makes a dent in the experience bar. Fucking hell. I'm not going to disengage the lock. Save it. Let's do this. Okay, well, we know roughly what side it is on and where it is. Perfect. Pre war money. Ball caps. Remember, pre war stuff that weighs nothing and is worth a decent amount, things like pre war money, great to pick up. They weigh nothing and they're worth money. You're carrying around free profit. I didn't see if I had loads of uh, bag space, I'd pick up the fucking camera. Uh, loads of weight, even. I don't know what this used to be. It used to be a building of some description. Obviously, it was a building. I mean, like, you know, it used to be. It's like, as a reset. I think it's a hotel. Yeah. Uh, it did say abandoned apartments, though, didn't it? So. Fucking two new color quantums. New color light sh lampshade. It's nice to have two. Gotta be close to. Yeah, the thing for the quantum. I can't remember what it's called, the search for quantum or whatever. There's like a handbrake. Right, upstairs it is. Fucking savages. Alright, let's um, heal myself up. I'll be 
pin. So you already make up your bob for your bobby pins. Empty savage. Nothing in there. In terms of repeatable quests, the uh, pre-war books are still one of the better ones. There's pretty much money there. Roller skates, toaster, an ammo box for some reason. Toilet water is the worst. Nine rads, four HP. Sometimes it's a lot worse than that though. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to drop there. As soon as I can find out where the repeatable quest is, I should probably have looked it up as well for the teddy bear. Yeah. Right away in stim pack, always nice. I'd have to quick save and stuff so often and spam vats like a madman when I, if I was doing this on a harder difficulty. It's the lack of. Gonna, I am gonna pick up that teddy bear and I'm gonna draw. Fuck it, let's drop the um, scrap metal. They don't give. They don't give much anyway, so. No idea what the teddy bear repeatable quest gives there. It's just money. That won't be so much of an issue. Because I've got 33, so that's like a fucking fuck ton of money. Pretty well baseball cap. A lot of baseball stuff in here. Maybe a bit worth a lot. Stimpack, yay! More Stimpacks. Nuka Cola truck, cool. Sugar bombs, pre -war. Ooh! Okay, that didn't like getting pushed against the fucking um, side. Lock door, any trip wires, no trip wires. So far, anyway. Put on money. Stealth boy, my fusion cell. And a laser rifle, which is great, because what I can now do is go to my weapons. If I look at the laser rifle, compare that metal blaster. Lovely. 44 magnum rounds and a scoped 44 magnum. More pre war money. Let's keep searching there before we go to that safe. That pre war smell, it's all nice. Ah, oh, assault rifles and ammo boxes. This is what's great about coming to these kind of places. Right, let's repair some stuff. Right, infiltrator, repair it with two of them. Nice, I want to see what the infiltrator's like. Uh, let's put that on free. There. Seven and eight can be like. Eight can be like the alien blaster, I guess. Just in case. Yeah, just in case. Oh, and that extra Chinese assault rifle. Sounds fucking for a silenced weapon it sounds fucking loud. Look at this shit, there's more stuff. Hat of the people. Small guns plus five. Well it explains why there's those are Chinese weapons in here, obviously. These were probably Chinese agents of some description. Which is pretty cool. We'll go to Apple Hat of the People, let's have a look. Ah, uh, definitely. That's cool. Anyway. I'll get rid of that. Moving on.
Fuck off over there. Flame of fuel. Woo! It's a nice surprise, wasn't it? Flame of fuel in there. And I haven't got my um. Wherever they are. Fuck it. More the time. Wherever the fuck they are. Oh shit, son. Well, there's some experience. <laughs> so, it must be some nice treasure. Be in the very end room. Let's see what there was then. I mean, I suppose why could if I'd have known that they were all going to be there like that, I could have aggroed them, lured them out. Uh, I could then have, you know, shot that. Um, you know, shot the the you know exploding stuff and voila, cooked trogs. Although it just does light explosion damage and maybe sets them on fire. Not, you know, the best one in the universe. Stimpack and Bobby Pin, however. And an extra teddy bear is always welcome. Bobby Pin. The pre war book starts. Meth needs more pre war books. Plunger. Guy in the bathtub, a vacuum cleaner, and whiskey. Oh, I'm a bit gutted, really. There was nothing useful in there. Kind of sucks. Oh well, never mind. No more enemies, so that's the end of that. Can we go through there? No, I can't. What I can do, though, is I can just do this. Oh no, through all the wall. Uptown. Push back to the store we had earlier. Right, I'm going to save it there. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, check out my other videos, and I'll see you for the next one.